In this tutorial, we will create a customer support ticketing system in Vue.js, Node.js and MongoDB. We created a separate tutorial to do the registration, login and logout. I will mention its link in the description of this video. So the idea is simple, user will create tickets about his complaints and they will be answered by customer support representatives. So go ahead and register two accounts, one for user and for representative. Open your MongoDB compass, and you will see two users. You can manually set the representative by changing its role. Then in your home page create a tickets component. Import this component. and define it as component. Then we need to create this file in our components folder. In this file, first we will simply show a message. Then we will create a button that will open a modal to create ticket. Then we will create a bootstrap modal to show a form to create ticket. Create a modal body, and in this body we will create a form. Each ticket will have title. A description. And optional screenshots. And in card footer, we will create a submit button for this form.
Now we need to create this method that will call an Ajax to save the ticket. First, we will import Axios module to call Ajax and suite alert to display pop-up alerts. Then we will create this data variable and initialize it as false. Now we will create this method. Set creating ticket to true to display a loader. Create form data object from form. And call an Ajax with post method. Set the URL of the request. Attach form data. And pass headers for authentication. After the response is received, hide the loader. Display an alert. And if the response is success, then reset the form. Then we need to create this tickets module in our API modules folder. Export this module. It will have init function and it will receive app instance as parameter. Save this in a separate variable so we can use it inside callbacks. Include express module. Create router with this express module. And tell the app that this router will handle all the requests that starts from tickets in the URL. Then we need to include this module in server, JS. And call the init method when the database is connected. Then back in tickets module, create a post route to handle the request. Pass auth as middleware, we will include this middleware in a moment. Get the authenticated user. Get title and description from create ticket form. Check if the fields are not empty. Create an images array. Check if user has uploaded multiple images. Then loop through all the images. And save them in images array. If there is single image then simply push it. Then we will call a recursive function to save the image one by one. Include the auth module. After the init function, we will create our recursive function. Save this object. Check if there is any image in the array. If there is no image, then simply call the callback function and stop the recursion. Otherwise, we will check if the image is valid, if it has size equal to zero, it means it is not valid. In this case, we will increment the index and move to the next image in array by calling the recursive function. Else we need to save the image. To save an image, we must include the file system module. First, read the file. Check if there is any error in reading the file. Then we will set the path where we will save the image. And write the file. Check if there is any error. 
If not, then push and save pads array. If this is the last image in array, then stop the recursion and call the callback function. Otherwise, we will increment the index and continue the recursion. We also need to include this object ID, this can be included from MongoDB module. After the image is saved, we need to remove it from memory. So once the recursion stops and the callback is called, we need to save the ticket in database. So create a new object. Set ID. Set title and description. Save screenshots array. Save user who created this ticket. Set status to open. Array to store all replies. And create and updated fields to current timestamp. And insert in tickets collection. Send the response back to client. Now try and create a ticket. Set the title and description. And select images. And hit the submit button. Refresh the MongoDB compass. So a new document is inserted. And all images has been saved in uploads folder. In the next tutorial, we will display all tickets created by authenticated user.